Wouldn't hurt. What you got there, Ashley? Huh? Bunch of hopefuls. Okay. Try and ride your coattails. Doing, uh... Ah, and here he is. MP, my name is Jocelyn Davies, executive producer for Top Takes Daily. So nice to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. As I was telling Jocelyn earlier, uh, we are open to any discussion involving one Chef Owens, but we do expect those questions to be respectful. And if you wish to move on quickly from any given question, we expect that desire to be honored. And as I was just explaining to Miss St. Germain, this is a reputable program on a billion dollar network. We take <laughs> procedures and standards very seriously and will of course treat MP No with snacks up. in the dressing room. Oh my gosh. I will take care of Second it. Second day this week. Got it. Yeah. It's done. Chips, a billion dollar cookies, network. crackers, popcorn. Got I'm it. Not Got it. For Thank much. you so much. 60 seconds. Thank you. Very reputable. That stand right there. <laughs> we'll of course treat MP with the utmost respect and professionalism at all times. Will you guys have snacks? Oh, yeah, we got snacks. Hey, and I'm good. <laughs> Let's do it. Jocelyn, I mean it. Okay? This is not the day for Kendrick to try to go viral over anything. Are we clear? Ash, like, loosen up a little bit. I can handle Perkins. That's no problem. See? And he's a big boy. He can take care of himself. Oh, of that, I'm sure. <laughs> but I can take care of myself. Okay? Let's not forget that. <laughs> okay. You ready to head a set now? Yeah. Yeah. Let's head over. Everyone, I'd like to introduce MP. Hey, hey, how's it going? Sam Woods, big fan. Nice to meet you. Thanks, man. Of course, you know JJ. My guy. Good to see you. And Kendrick. Hey, what's going on, superstar? Oh, awkward. All right, you're going to sit right here adjacent to me. Thanks. All right. Places, everyone. All right, everybody. We're going live. Thanks for coming on the show. Here we yeah, go. Anytime. Uh, Four, three, and welcome back to Top Takes Daily. And for our next segment, we are joined live in studio by the guy everybody is talking about, our very special guest, MP. Welcome to the program. My man, thank you guys for uh, having me. On. Yeah, thank yeah. you for joining us. Now, I know this might be a sensitive subject, but I just want to get right into it. We all saw what happened on draft night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but... We haven't heard your side of the story. So I'm wondering, how does it feel to be on the receiving end of, of a mixed reaction like that on, on what should be the most enjoyable night of your life?
that just comes with the territory, you know? Like, we make a lot of money, and it's all because of those passionate fans out there. Night in and night out, coming into the games and showing their support. It's because of them, you know what I'm saying? And yes, the fans are free to express their feelings however way they want, but it don't matter to me. I, I mean, are we serious right now? Listen, <laughs> MP, with all due respect, do you expect us to believe that? If I'm my own so-called fans uh -huh. were booing me, that wouldn't sit right with me at all. Yo, Kendrick, my man, it, it, it doesn't bother me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know in the long run people will come around and, uh, you know, see what I'm all about. You know, and that's just giving everything that I got to this game. You know, um, not only to the team, but to this, this, this city, man. You know, it's, it's my job. Proving my worth to these fans is my job. You know, so I know right now they may be booing, but soon enough they're going to be cheering for me. MP, let's stay with the draft for a moment. Mm -hmm. A big part of the reaction to your selection was the fact that Shep Owens, your biggest rival, was still on the draft board. That's right. But a, a lot of people think he has the higher upside due to his athleticism and the fact that he has loads of untapped potential as a relative newcomer to this game, whereas you've been trying to work on your skill set for the last decade plus. How would you respond to people who think you've got the higher floor but the lower ceiling? Mm. I mean, look, Shep would be a great track and field player. Wow. I mean, all you got to do is run fast, jump high, and you get a medal. You feel me what I'm saying? Okay. I mean, but if you want to be the best hoop in the world, you got to shoot, you got to defend, you got to, you know, you got to think at a high level, and Shep does not do that. Oh, shots fired. <laughs> it's the truth. Perk, you know I've been in MP's corner the whole time. Some would. You don't think, Sh come on now. Come on, man. You don't think Shep can learn those things? JJ, man, you know... Honestly, I, I really don't. I really don't, man. I, me, I've been working on my craft for years, for decades at that. You know, and my results speak for themselves in both wins and losses. I mean, what has Shep done so far? Other than filming his little reality TV show and going around shopping for chains, he ain't done nothing. It's a good show. <laughs> Sir, I'm, come on, man. Um, it's more entertaining than his game. Yeah. It, that, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. But, you know, me, I'm a student in the game. I've watched plenty of tape on this guy, and he just doesn't think on a high level. And he doesn't make game-winning plays. Simply put, simply put, not like I do, at least. You know, you can dunk from the free throw line, you can win the dunk trophy, whatever, whatever, but those guys winning that dunk trophy aren't the same guys winning Larry O'Brien at the end of the season. And that's just facts. Mm. MP, you know we keep it real on here. I got to ask you, man to man, how do you respond to Chef Owens calling you out on his reality show? Oh, wow. This dude took shots at you. He took shots at your family. He even took shots at your girl. What do you say to something like that? You know, I, I'm going to say this as calmly as possible. Because at the end of the day, it's disappointing to me. You know what I'm saying? I mean, to me, basketball is a place where you express joy. Yeah, I want to beat my opponent, my opponent, don't get me wrong. So in the heat of the moment, words do get exchanged. But to talk about another man's, another man's family? Like, fam, I'm embarrassed for him. My man has a lot of growing up to do. Well, what I want to know and we want to know, mm -hmm. are you going to exchange words? Are y'all going to exchange words? <laughs> uh... You believe him. Mm. That's it. You know, that's what my parents told me, and that's just how I live. Well, this has been unforgettable, and I'd love to continue this conversation, but unfortunately, we are out of time. MP, thank you for joining wait, us. Wait, so that's it's it? It's been a... And we really appreciate you answering the tough questions. We wish you all the best, you and your family and your girl. Uh, coming up next, we talk early season contenders jokes, and pretenders. But first, this commercial break.
propel your performance on both ends of the court in a pair of New Balance. AMP, got something for you. Josh, what's going on, man? MP, how you doing? Bro, I'm chilling, man. I'm chilling. Yo, again, man, thank you for taking the time to see me, bro. That's love. Man, no problem. You know, I was in a similar situation last year, so I think I can help. Hold, hold on. Didn't you go top five last year? And the people loved you, too, bro. Man, I went six. And yeah, a lot of people liked me, but there was also a lot of people who were shocked that I went that high. So, especially on social media. Bro, man, tell me about it. Social media could be so brutal, man. Man, that's what happens when it's all anonymous, I guess. Still, you see it all, and it affects you. All right, so, so, that's a good point you said. So, like, how do you deal with that doubt then? Well, I've always been someone who likes setting up teammates, helping them succeed, so as long as my guys around me were thriving, I didn't really care what anybody said about me. Wait, but hold on. Like, you, you gotta play well too, bro. It's not all about the team. Yeah, know? well, me playing well, my, you know, means my guys are playing well around me, so that's just my game, and I can't really separate the two. Bro, you got the vision, man. You, you got the vision out there. You dropping them down. I see you. Yeah, I appreciate that. Look, I got to bounce, but it was nice talking to you, man. Hit me up if you ever want to hoop or you need any advice or whatever. All right, let's get it. MP, good to see you, man. Let's get started. I bet. 